Space is considered by many researchers to be the greatest mystery of all. In fact, we still know almost nothing about what is going on outside our Earth. Most observations are based on theories. Most new discoveries raise more questions than they provide answers. At the same time, for many people, this is where the fascination of space lies. What is hidden there? How did it originate? Is it still expanding? And of course, the question of whether there is intelligent life somewhere outside our world. Here are five curious discoveries made in recent years on which the researchers are still working and which should clarify at least some of the open questions in the search for answers. We leave the Earth, the only home we know, to go to the farthest reaches of the cosmos. If you would like to join us on our journey, please support us with a thumbs up. Subscribe to Simply Space and look forward to the videos that will be waiting for you in the future. Let us begin our journey through the vastness of the universe. The Supernova 1987A a supernova is probably one of the most exciting phenomena in space that researchers can already observe today. Roughly speaking, it is the moment just before a star dies. Throughout history, people from different eras and regions of the world have been able to observe supernovas in the sky. There are records of scholars who spoke of how new and very bright shining objects suddenly appeared in the sky and disappeared again after some time. The supernova of 1604, for example, is one of the first comprehensively documented events in the starry sky, which even at that time triggered discussions and overturned some of the theories that were popular at the time. In the case of the 1987A supernova, even more information was gained about what seems to be happening in distant galaxies. The 1987A supernova was the first time that NASA and other space research experts were able to observe these effects with relatively modern technology. This meant that it was no longer necessary to rely on records from the past, and it was even possible to follow the course of the supernova in the sky using various measures. This particular supernova was also interesting for various other reasons. It is the first case in which the predecessor star was already identified. So, the star itself was known, and when it finally imploded, the supernova could be assigned to this very star. In addition, the event did not behave exactly as science would have predicted. Neither a strong radiation was to be suspected at the place, nor was it foreseeable whether a neutron star formed directly. Despite intensive observations over many years, the supernova 1987A is still being analyzed with regard to its evolution. What has been determined, however, is the emission of neutrinos. Just before the event could be seen in the sky, transmitters reported that they noticed an increased emission. This gave the researchers new insights into these important particles, which make up a considerable part of the universe and its stars. Nuclear pasta. When you talk about nuclear pasta, you are not talking about what you get from some delivery services if you order just before closing time. Instead, it is probably one of the most massive and dense materials known in the current universe. Researchers assume that this special mass is created at the moment when a star collapses and the remaining parts gather around the remaining core in a particularly strong density. There are no real observations so far. The realization that this nuclear pasta exists is based more on calculations. What is special about it is that it contradicts the laws of nature known so far and therefore belongs to the degenerate matter. The special feature of this matter is that it can be created within a few moments. This brief moment in which a planet or star collapses with all its mass is one of the most impressive events the world has to offer. At the same time, all the energy has to go somewhere, and the remains of the planet with all its atoms and neutrons have to somehow reform. Because of the mass and the force of attraction, the nuclear pasta is created, which can without a doubt be called the strongest matter that has ever been found so far. According to calculations from the USA and Canada, it takes no less than 10 million times the force needed to destroy steel to break nuclear pasta back down into its component parts. 
Moreover, due to the steadily increasing density, it can be assumed that it will continue to increase during the process of collapse. But what happens to it in the end, and whether fragments of this pasta can already be found somewhere in space, is not yet known. Haumea, Neptune's dwarf planet with rings. Neptune, with its composition and moons, is one of the planets about which comparatively little is known in research so far. It has been the subject of the debate whether Pluto is a planet in its own right or just a dwarf planet which is actually in the orbit of Neptune. This research may also have been the reason why two teams of researchers succeeded in finding another dwarf planet in the immediate vicinity of Neptune, Haumea. At first glance, it is not unusual, since Neptune has many different objects in its orbit and has therefore been the target of researchers from around the world for a very long time. But what is most interesting is that Haumea apparently has its own rings, a rarity on a dwarf planet. One special feature is also the shape of the dwarf planet. It would not appear round to the optical eye, but rather like an ellipse, which is a rarity among planets. But it does not end there. Furthermore, it seems to have its own moons and an orbit of similar length to Pluto, where it welcomes most of the planets in the solar system at least briefly in orbit. All in all, the planet is a rarity and seems to question typical observations and findings that were believed to be true about objects in our solar system. The key to most of the secrets may be found in the past of Haumea, whereby it is of course only a theory from scientists. In general, there are other objects with their own rings, such as the asteroid Chariklo, which is still a good deal smaller than Haumea. It is the combination of all known properties that suggests that Haumea may once have been much larger and collided with another object. This could also be the origin of the moons and rings that dominate the image of the dwarf planet in research today. Further investigations will be necessary in any case. KIC 8462852, Tabby Star. Tabby Star shines brightly in the sky, and that is exactly what attracted the attention of researchers. While most stars and planets show only slight variations in brightness, for example when a moon passes by, Tabby's star shows dips of up to 16% in brightness. The results were quickly interpreted in many different ways, from fragments of a planetary explosion in the distance, to structures or buildings built by aliens. Everything was represented in the debate. While it was not possible to prove that it was any object of extraterrestrial nature, over the years and through constant observation, another explanation was found. For example, the strong difference in the brightness of the star should be explained mainly by the interplanetary dust. This seems to be particularly strong in the vicinity, and thus, on some days, has a considerable effect on how bright the star appears. However, as almost always in space research, this too is simply a theory. Quasars For a long time, people have puzzled over what the quasars are all about. In the meantime, it has been established that they are very special forms of active galaxies. When observed, quasars are usually perceived as a point that appears particularly bright and in typical measurements also emits strong radiation. Unlike a star or planet, however, it is by no means the residual energy from a supernova, but actually an active galaxy, which usually has a strong black hole at its center. Due to the constant attraction by the black hole, friction and heat is generated which can eventually be represented in the energy of light. They come in many different shapes and represented colors, and in the end, they are an important part of the research that is currently being done with the black holes in space. These are of course only a few excerpts from the great mysteries that the universe still holds for us and for research. Which events and phenomena can you think of that have to do with the universe and about which too little is still known in research? <laughs>